So for example, here's the Terror Blade. What's up guys, Pedgwin here, and today I'm going to be showing you some unobtainable prefixes. For example, as you can see here, I'm holding a tiny unicorn, and let me compare it next to a massive unicorn, look at that. So as you can see, there's all sorts of different crazy things. This is a Nebula Ar Arcanum, and this is a small one and a large one compared side by side. Here's a large breathing rod and all that stuff. It even works with glow sticks, look at that. So I'm going to be showing you some unobtainable prefixes today, just to see how all of them work together and see what crazy things can happen when you can make some very interesting combinations. Let's get into it, shall we? So, as you can see, I've got these um, prefixes here. Um, these are all obtainable via um, uh, server commands like on T-Shark or an inventory editor. Um, so, it is legit in the game. I'm not using any mods or anything, but you do have to go a roundabout way of getting them. Um, but when you do get them, you can show off to your friends and stuff like that. So, if I run around with like this massive unicorn on a stick and someone has their unicorn theirs looks all tiny and stuff they're gonna be jealous that mine's massive right and there's all sorts of stuff you can do um it's, for example breathing reads and stuff unfortunately the breathing reads don't work when you're in water look i'm drowning but my breathing read is poking out of the water and if i use the tiny one it is barely poking out right so it's kind of interesting how it works it's just a visual no differences there and look at here, what we see is the tiny glow sticks and the massive glow sticks. And these don't make any difference um, when you throw them on the floor. It's just what they look like in your hand. And they actually do give off more light because they are bigger. Um, I remember back in the day there was like this mod where you could make massive, massive stuff. So you could have like a massive glow stick and it would actually glow up, glow up the whole entire area it covered. But these are technically like legit obtainable in the game. So if you go on a server or something, you can show off your... You can go up to your friend and say, my glow stick's bigger than yours. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so there's cool stuff you can do. And I'm going to show off some other stuff. There's not just sizes that you can do. There's also speeds and all sorts. So I've got a bunch of stuff here and we're going to be showing off. So for example, there's two different types of slime guns. There's the hasty one. Look how fast this is shooting and how far it's shooting. Now let's compare it to the, the slow one. It, there's, there's actually a big difference, like it shoots further and slower, but that's just one thing. Let's move on to the next things here, and I'm going to actually use some accessories and some armor as well. So I'm going to use all violent accessories. Uh, that Was that the right one? Oh, violent, sorry. There we go. And we're going to be using a violent <laughs> alloyed armor as well. This is actually impossible to get, but you can get it via... Haxoras, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna use rapid weapons. So, for example, here's the Terror Blade. With full rapid, that's that's 10% velocity and 12% spe speed, and then just melee speed on all of our stuff with melee speed on our armor with like. <laughs> it's just hilarious to look at, and you can do this with absolutely anything. So, for example. I can do it with that. I can use the rapid <laughs> cracker, which kind of breaks. It snaps off the string. It's so insane. And then you can also use these and bananas and the terrarium. The terrarium is the really buggy one. Look at this. Look at it. Whoa, I got it stuck in. I never seen that. You can actually get it stuck in areas. When I was trying to use it before, it wouldn't get stuck in anything. It would just snap. It'd like fly across the whole entire world. It's so buggy. But, wow, if you do it in the water, it actually gets stuck in stuff. Look at that. I didn't know that. Um, daybreak. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm on my server right now, so let me just check something out. Um, I have expert mode enabled, so the, the Aya Cthulhu, just the regular Aya Cthulhu, what we're going to fight now. Um, it should be like super strong because we are on a server. So let's just have a. Oh god! See how many of these we can get stuck into him. Look at him. He's got 12,000 HP. <laughs> oh god! Oh my goodness. He has 12,000 HP because on expert mode. Oh god! On expert mode, everything gets scaled with um <laughs> with everything pretty much. Oh my goodness! But I'm just I just made this quick video just to show you some cool little prefixes that you can mess around with. I just wanted to show you that this guy's like, what's going on? What is going on? Who just summoned an Eye Cthulhu and killed it? All I can see is carnage. I think I think the bodies rain down on him from above. <laughs> It's just a giant Ayaka Thulu falls on top of him. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I just wanted to show you these goofy 
um, prefixes and stuff. I mentioned this ages ago on Twitter and a lot of people seemed interested by it. So I decided just to show you guys. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.